Here are five tips to help you compose a useful tweet. Number one, don't just tweet or retweet a URL. One of the biggest red flags for me to not click on a URL is a tweet with a URL alone. It looks super spammy, it doesn't look enticing, and it doesn't make me want to click. Um, so first off, if you want to shorten your URL, use the most of your space that you have on Twitter. You can use a website like Bitly, and that will help you do that, to where you can use your URL as part of your tweet, not a standalone tweet. Number two, make it catchy, but keep it honest. No clickbait. Do not put something on your tweet that is just clickbait. Has nothing to do with your, your article you're posting or whatever you're posting. Rather, look through your article or whatever you're posting, find some keywords that you can use that look applicable and eye-catching to your audience, and you can use that to compose your tweet around your URL. Number three, use appropriate hashtags. This kind of goes back to reading your article or what you're posting about. So find hashtags that will be applicable to your audience, like solar is one that I use, tribal is another one I use, you could use tribal land. There are several different hashtags for this article, but these are some of the ones that I chose to use that have something to do with my article. Number four, use a photo or video. There have been studies after studies after studies that have proven that tweets get higher engagements when there are pictures or photos used. It's that simple, so do it. Number five, tag involved parties. Find anyone who's involved in what you're posting, especially if it's good, tag those parties, they'll see that tweet and they'll be able to retweet it or quote it. Then your audience will have the party that you're tweeting about at their fingertips and they can follow them.